once again a furious crowd in the city center of the port city of Karachi, many wearing symbolic coffins. Despite the intense heat, thousands of protesters took to the streets to express their support for the Bahraini people. As violent Saudi backed crackdown on anti government protesters rages on in Bahrain. Demonstrators here in the financial capital of Pakistan are urging the Zardari administration to condemn what they say is the Saudi backed brutal crackdown on peaceful pro democracy protesters in Bahrain and they call for an end to Western interference in the Muslim world. On Saturday, in the eastern city of Sitra, regime forces clashed with protesters with the soldiers firing at the crowds. Earlier in the week, regime forces raided a medical center in the city and arrested some doctors. A military court has also sentenced several detained protesters to death. <laughs> We want our government to condemn these atrocities in strongest words and stop the recruitment of our soldiers for Bahraini military as mercenaries because it is defaming Pakistan, which is already facing internal and external issues. We demand the Pakistani government to snap diplomatic ties with the countries responsible for these atrocities and to openly condemn the crackdown in Bahrain. Speakers at the rally also condemned incidents of desecration of the Holy Quran in Florida by Terry Jones and in Bahrain by Saudi forces. I wish Saudis must be quick enough to respond to the call of the Palestinian brothers and sisters who are being killed by the Zionist regime and prove that they are on the side of the oppressed and not on the side of the oppressor. They are like opposing the people, they are burning the mosque, they are burning the Quran. So all these acts are Islamic and we think they are not truly really deserving the title of Khadim e Hariman. As the rally reached its ending point, the message from the commercial hub of Pakistan was clear. The people of Bahrain, although our government remains silent, but we, the people, are standing shoulder to shoulder in solidarity with you. Mohammad Turi, Press TV, Karachi.